Tonight, a longtime Detroit resident is on a crusade to keep her block clean. So when she spotted something suspicious, she watched and she took pictures. Then she called our Ronnie Dahl. And Ronnie has the story from Detroit's east side. Take a look. Residents in this Eastside neighborhood are fighting to keep the blight from spreading. They take pride in their property. So when one neighbor noticed a cement hauler coming down the street acting suspicious, she had to do something. Around 4 o'clock Thursday afternoon, Karen was outside enjoying the weather when she noticed something odd. A cement truck came down the street the wrong way. They were in the area because they were repairing patchwork in the street. But her street, Garvin, was completed days ago, so she thought it was odd until... He came to the field over here, and he pulled out the cement slide, and I watched. He started watering it with a water hose, and then he started to... Get the water into the drum while the drum was circling. I figured he was going to dump. Karen says she had to say something. She had to do something. And I yelled, Get the hell out of here. And he saw that I had my camera out and he took off like crazy with that slide flapping in the wind. Karen got some pretty good pictures. She contacted me. I traced the plate to Rock May LLC in Plymouth. I talked to a guy on the phone. When we got disconnected, I went looking for answers. Only there was no Rock May listed on the directory, but there was another contracting company, which is connected. Friday afternoon, the door was locked and the lights off. Eventually, I got a call from Pete. He says the pictures Karen took don't tell the real story. The employee wasn't dumping, but was doing what is known as a washout. And the client told the driver to do it on the Gavin Street lot. It's not the hauler's job to determine if the location is legal or not. Try telling that to Karen. I was fuming. I was fuming and I reacted. It's, it's what we have to do to keep our neighborhoods clean. Late this afternoon, I was able to reach the client of the cement hauler. An employee tells me they did absolutely nothing wrong. This mess is going to be for the Detroit Police Department to figure out. A citation could be issued. On Detroit's east side tonight, Ronnie Dahl, 7 Action News.